Welcome dear viewers. Why do you need to convert from legacy BIOS to UEFI? UEFI has better programmability, greater scalability, higher performance, and higher security. Here are the differences between UEFI and legacy. As well, you need to convert legacy to UEFI, before upgrading, Windows 10 to Windows 11. And now before starting the conversion. If this is the first time you visit my channel, subscribe to my channel, and activate the notification bell, to be notified of new videos. Let's check the Windows version. Also, we need to check the boot mode. Press the Windows key plus R, and run misinfo32. It is legacy. If you want to know how to check it with three methods, I will leave the link for the video in the description box below. And it is on the above right corner on the screen, suggested videos. Now, let us back up the data by creating a restore point. Let's review the disk partition before the conversion. Now to start the conversion, run the command prompt as administrator. Run this command mbr to gpt.exe space slash convert space slash allow full os. I will leave the command in the description box below. As you see conversion was completed successfully. Start your PC and check boot mode and the disk partition. Congratulations, conversion successfully done. Don't forget to share, subscribe, like, and turn on the notification bell. Thanks for watching.